to practice the engagement of the core muscles that help support us in the lower from plank to chaturanga with the protracted position. If you don't know what I mean by that, go ahead, reach the arms forward. The shoulder blades are spread or protracted and then take your arms to chaturanga position. Often when that happens, these guys start to wing off the back. So we use, go ahead, push these muscles in, those muscles pushing back to keep the shoulder blades protracted. This core exercise, the top edge of the block is intersecting with the bottom edge of his shoulder blade as he lays back. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay, uh, a little bit lower. There you go. All right, so that's gonna cause those ribs to flare out, lift up again, and we're gonna make it just a bit lower. And there you go. How does that feel? Perfect, good. So we're gonna try and get these guys to disappear. Go ahead, interlace your fingers behind your head. Lift the head and chest up and make them disappear, hug them in. Often what happens is in this, we'll lose the front of our neck. Just lift the chin slightly away from the chest, split the difference, so that your neck is in the same position as it would be if you were standing upright. And then we're gonna do little pulses, lift, 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 lift and hold, 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 yes. See how long I actually think he'll outweigh my patience before <laughs> I do his. It's just chilling. But if you're like me, you're like making some faces about now, that's okay. You just have to remind yourself, yoga, you breathe, you soften your face. You hold it a little longer and then you forget to soften your face and you make faces and then you relax about it and the cycle just keeps going and then next thing you know, you're done. All right, relax. 